this might be dead. Ooh, I got, got one. Oh, little baby, little baby. They kind of run this pole here. Little baby, you guys. First keeper. First keeper, you guys. There we go. First keeper right here. So I might step under the bridge. There you go. With a cricket hook. I didn't even switch it over. Still got the cricket hook for the bluegill. It is in there too. It is in there. Ooh. I don't even think I brought pliers. There we go, got it out. First keeper, YouTube. Get back in there. There you go, you two. Let's get back out there. What's going on, brother? You doing all right? I think I got another one right here, YouTube. I think I got another one. You doing any good today? Huh? Oh, nice. What's that? Like for your fish? Chad? Oh, okay. What'd you do? You uh, threw a net out there or something? Or you, you went and caught some Chad? Where you getting from? I hear him? Threw a net. Yeah. Big old keeper you got. Big old keeper. There we go. Keeper number two. Keeper number two. Oh, I say big and big for it. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Yes indeed. That cricket hook, that cricket hook getting the job done. Like I said, I didn't bring my um. I didn't bring my pliers or nothing. There we go, got it out of there. Keeper number two. Yeah, buddy. Yes, indeed. All right, it's slow, but I'm getting fish. So these posts are flexible. When you see the bend, it don't thump like that. It just bends and the line move out like it's swimming. That's when you know you got one, you set the hook. Now if it's a big one, of course it might just drop down, but that's how I can tell. When that pole raise up, they swimming up with it. So if that bend raise up like that, it's one on it. Uh-huh. Ah, uh, little baby. <sighs> nice one, big one, big, big one you got. Big one, nice one, yes indeed. Fish number three. 
but not big one, but for some radios. Another T11 incher. There you go, YouTube. Another T11 incher. That's three. Three keeps, baby. There we go. There we go. Nice crappie. Nice keeper crappie. There we go, guys. Got that pole bent. Got that pole bent. There you go. Another keeper crappie. Catch and clean, and we'll see how that goes. All right. Big old crappie. Big old crappie. They here, brother. Ooh, he heavy. They here. They just got to uh, that pole bent. Just gotta find them. I think this is number seven. I believe this is number seven. You're getting that top hook with this crooked hook, crooked hook, it ain't coming out. That's a nice one, you guys. That is a nice slab. Starting to add up. Starting to add up, YouTube. Get some dinner on you guys. I got a beat up cricket hook. I got a drop shot. I'm going against all eyes against crappie fishing. I got a drop shot with a with a weight. Just like uh just like you uh I don't know. Red ear fishing, bluegill, crop catfish and bass. I guess crappie fishing. So what do you think, YouTube? Out here trying to put a little work in on these hot days. I don't think I crappie fish in a while or, or caught crappie of this quantity in a while, probably since uh, May or something. Maybe June, maybe, but maybe May. So I got about eight in there, seven or eight. So that's that's okay for our summertime. This water about 90 degrees. Oh yeah, that's, that's, that's really okay um, amount of crappies. Honestly, you guys, it's hard to catch crappies in the summertime. That's why a lot of people stop fishing for crappies in the summertime. They just go to bluegill or something. So let's see if we can get us one more. We're gonna call it a day. Oh yeah, my battery going dead. I'm about to get ready to get out this water right now. Right freaking now. The battery is going dead, you guys, so it's time for me to go. I brought the wrong battery. My battery, I'm bird. I got this in number five, top speed. You see, I'm barely moving, you guys. Barely got you, barely making it. So I'm about to. Once I put my weight in the front, I'm pretty much, yeah, right here. So I'm pretty much sunk on the ground, but this is how I get off. All right, you two, we're gonna clean the fish and then we're gonna get loaded up, we're gonna get to the house. All right, guys, so remember, 
I keep my eyes, so let's see what we got in here. See how the body's frozen? That's how hard that ice is. I mean, the ice pack. I'm sorry. All right, guys, so I end up getting six. Sometimes that video don't show the good, the uh, size of them, but they some pretty good. Well, these two are right at 10, but that's a big one. This one, this one, that's a big one. So they all real nice guys so you two i'm gonna clean these up real quick play them up so you guys how to do it back here right up right right here on the waters and then we're gonna get to the house we're gonna get the cooking all right guys so got it plugged up in the truck i got the salt water fresh water piranha mr twister guys this right here is all i need to get the job done i got my plastic bag right here and i got my two my two ice packs in there so let's get it going First one, we'll start right here. Ice pack got it kind of frozen there. Bring it back. Flip it over. Under the tail. Grab the tail like I do. Pull. Flay number one. We got many more to go. There we go. Cut the skin off. Toss in the water. Flip it over. Same thing. Flip it over. Grab the tail. Pull. There we go. Play number two. Now, I'm keeping this part. Now you got the spine. I right, clean that up when I get home. I'm ready to go. It's hot. I'm ready to go. So I'm, I'm, I'm moving fast, you guys. Skin. Did I hit the bone? Let's see. Probably did, but let's see if we can let's see if we can fix this. Save it. There we go. There we go. Now I do notice. These grooves, I need to keep me a cutting board. That's why I'm having issues right now. But I'm gonna work around that though. And of course, they're not getting the full power. There you go. But it's getting enough power to get the job done. All right, you two, I'm gonna finish these four up and we'll see you at the house. Y'all just hold on to catching the, the cleaning cook uh, start. The cooking part, anyway, I can't wait. Um. Take my minnows out. Probably put some fresh batteries in here. Because I'm gonna try to use these minnows tomorrow. Uh, got my fish in here, you guys. Oh! So. I got so many rods that guys, I never, I did, some of them I never even used. So let's see. Guys, I got so many, look at that. YouTube, I got, it's so, look, look, look at all the minnows, $10. 
I was like that for four hours and I ain't put a dent in those minnows. So I should have put some more water in here, but it's okay. I'm gonna keep them. I'm gonna keep them cool. They're gonna last tomorrow, and I'm gonna fish with them tomorrow. So let me get in here and get started with the uh, cooking. Cause I'm hungry. All right, YouTube. I done made it to the house, you guys. And what I'm gonna do now? My wife got beans going. She got rice. She got fried chicken today. My favorite beans. Man, beans is my favorite. Got with some cornbread. I'm from the country, man. Fried chicken. Look like she might be making some cornbread. Ooh. I'm finna, oh yeah. Cornbread, just for cornbread. But I'm finna throw this fish together real quick. Four. Get in there. Yeah. Lucy sit there start 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 God please just give me something. <laughs> you go guys. This is what we have for today. Ooh, I did it in. I did it in, you got look at her boy. She got the beans going. She got white rice, fried uh chicken. Ooh, and she thick with it, chocolate. My goodness, Lord Jesus. All right, you guys, let me let me uh Get this clean up here for us. So what I'm doing is just kind of just cleaning it up a little bit, you guys. Let me uh let me get a little bowl somewhere. Do we got a container? I use it. I use this right here, you guys. I use this. So what I'm gonna do. Just get the get the meat a little clean. Mm -hmm. That 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 uh, what do you call it? That uh, what's that thing called? That ain't gonna work. That hot pot ain't gonna work. Mm -mm. You be on the stove. Mm -mm. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> you can put it, you can see, put it's it. not even uh, it's not even hot. Yeah, hot probably no joke. I mean, I it's guess not it's not even hot. Okay, put it over there for me, Okay. <laughs> you, YouTube, YouTube, what well, they get my famous bread, breading. All right. So this is crappie. I ain't got to do none of that seasoning stuff on crappie. I'm just gonna put that in the bread, my famous bread, and bam. I think it's, oh y'all, it's ready. Here we go, let's see what happens. Oh yep, there we go, first one, let's get it going. You got these are, I haven't, um, like I said, I'm excited that we're getting to eat crappies, and this amount, you guys, because I haven't caught. I guess one or two here and there, but I ain't caught six. And six good ones too, honestly. I mean, you know, it's been hot. It's been super, super hot. But these some good fillets, you guys. These are some good size fillets. Like I said, they won 13, 14. I only think they were 12 inch crappies, but these are, they were 10 and 11 for sure. And uh, them some nice little fillets right there. Keep, keep her size filet. One more. We'll go one more. There we go. First batch. Them beans looking good, boy. Ooh, yeah, it's it going down today. Guys, I'm gonna eat good today. I'll get ready. I'm gonna eat good. All right, YouTube, so great great day you guys great day on the lake so caught a couple small ones that not gonna be on the video uh they were just so small i just threw them back but i ended up with six like like y'all saw and um like i said it was a great day on the on, on the lake for crappies i don't catch a lot of them in the summertime so the ones i do catch i feel blessed to even catch those honestly i don't have no electronics things like that to go out and find stuff so 
I just go off of that old fashioned, you guys know how it is, just go and look for stuff and see if you can find them. But as soon as I got those live minnows, they produce a little bit for me. So, those flays, tell me what they look like, boy. Them carpet flays. Carpet flays are the real deal. And these here, I can't wait to eat one of those. But there we go. There we go, you guys. They're cooking fast, too, honestly. I got the stove going, so. Where's the, uh, <laughs> all right, I got you here. I got you here. That's what I'm looking for, spatula. Let's see. Go ahead and flip that over. Oh yeah, they cooking real fast. This stove is on point. This stove is back up and running. Oh, they're gonna be so good. And that's one thing about fish, they grits get hot enough, they cook fast, you guys. And I mean fast. Let me see here. Okay, we'll go with this. Put this right here. Honestly, we'll put this right here. Right here. And so some of you guys use fall paper and all that kind of stuff, newspaper and stuff like that. Just get some napkins and uh Just throw it in there. That's where the fish go. All right, the first batch is almost done. I'm ready to eat. Like I said, it's about one something. I went fishing about, I got there about nine and um, got off the water about right at noon time. And um, I'm starving, you guys. I had a protein shake this morning and a pack of, uh, I'll show you guys. I know some of y'all probably maybe even heard of these. The cars. Peanut pack, K-A-R-S, but I had a pack of those. Sweet and salty mix, so you know I'm starving. And um, and the wife, she's, man, she's the real deal. That's why I'm 260, I mean, I ain't 260, I'm, hey, let me take that back, guys. I'm 248, 247, I'm proud of myself. I used to be 260, 265, I got to 272. I was, a, I was an extreme power lifter, guys. Extreme power lifter. I was a big, big guy. So I'm proud of myself that I need to even get less. I need to get to about 220. Um, it's all about health now and heart. So let's see. I think we're done. Enough of the talking. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ready. Oh, yeah. Guys, tell me that don't look good. Come on. Tell me that do not look good. That grease is fresh, like a million bucks. All right, there we go. All right, let's get the next batch in. All right, so we go, here we go. Just tossing it up, flip it around a little bit. Get it coated. There we go. I'm trying to do all the flays first if I do the spine. There we go. All right, guys, y'all should be proud of me, man. This is a back-to-back -back catch and cook, and I never done that before. I really don't even do these because I'm not really a good cook, but you guys asked for it, so let's see if we can we can present this for the channel. Make sure I get a lot of comments, a lot of likes, maybe even some share if possible. Or some subscriptions. Ooh, that'd be nice. Get some new subscribers to come to the family. Man, I welcome all of y'all. I welcome all of y'all. Give me tips too how to fish. I don't just want to give out knowledge, so give me some knowledge. Okay, we get one more in there. Or two more, maybe. Is there another, is there another uh, fillet? I think it's one more fillet. There we go, one more. Big one, too. It's a big fillet, you guys. Get them up in there. You want, you, want, you want it to be coated. Coated good. There we go. All right, so let's see. 
make a little room here. Okay, yeah, we go right there. Okay, and we'll put this big nice one right there. There you go. Second batch, YouTube, second batch. All right, YouTube, about to flip it over. I let this one cook a little bit longer to get a little hard, because these are the ones I like. I like mine to be crisp, really good, so. This is a little bit more, cook a little bit better, or longer, I'm sorry, than the first batch. I'll be in need. The wife likes it like that. I like a little bit darker. Like her. Alright, so once this is done, then we'll do the spines with the tails. And we'll be ready to eat. It's chow time. All right, guys, so let's see uh, what this second batch looks like. Oh, yeah, it's ready. It's ready. So this second batch is just a little bit darker than that first batch over here. Ooh, so this one, this one down. Let's grab this one down. Five crappies. So I had six crappies. I got 12 fillets. Six. Look at hot. Six spines. Twelve fillets, six spines, 18 pieces of, of crappie. And then we got fried chicken, beans, and rice. Come on, man. Alright, guys, so. We, ladies, we got, ladies and gentlemen, we got the, uh, the the backs, the spines going here. So here we go. Ooh, that look good, y'all. That look good. They ready to, they ready to come out. There we go. One, two. So you guys see how six six crappies they make a meal, like a decent meal for. Two, three, four people. If you got some side and stuff going, that's 16 pieces of meat there. So let's get these other three in there, and uh, I'm just gonna put it in, in a fillet here. I mean, in the uh, bag. Well, I'm trying to get this on camera for you guys, but let's see, it might work out. There we go. Oh yeah, there we go. Look at how that coated, boy. That coat coated good. Are they gonna cook fast? These are thin, so they're gonna cook real fast, you guys. You can basically be done in a couple minutes. There we go. That looks good. That looks real good. The sauce up. Just drop it right over in that corner there. Bam. And uh, one more batch, and it's, and it's go time for me. So y'all tell me, guys. I know y'all like to see those crappie videos. I know y'all like to get locations. I caught these in the urban canals. Um, I'm gonna be honest with you. It's hard to catch it from the banks right now. It's summertime. It's probably hard to catch crappies anywhere from the bank. Um, catch them, I call them in deep water. Uh, well, for the canal, because the canal is only 15 feet deep in certain, in two locations. Everywhere else is six to eight feet, and then they get to two feet. So I call them in uh, about seven feet, and then I call them about 10 feet. So, and I call them on the bottom, you guys. So they're, at, they're down at the bottom. And, uh, for those six fish, I was out there for four hours. So let's show you how hard it was for me to catch. I think I caught nine in total. Three of them was too small. So let's see here. Oh yeah, it's getting there, you guys. It's getting there. 
So y'all let me know tomorrow. I think I'm gonna go out with Duke. Uh, he got him a kayak, and that's the that's the young guy that been fishing with me. The young guy, and he want me to show up some safety have safety things about the kayak. You remember, I just got mine, so I'm still learning. But I'm gonna help him out. I think we're gonna go and get on the bluegills, guys. Uh, the crappies and the kayak. I don't think you're ready for that yet. And um, I want to catch fish tomorrow, six, seven o'clock in the morning. Be out the water by ten o'clock. So. Cause we're gonna be out in the open. If I'm up on a bridge, I hang out there longer. It's easier, you know, it's, it's, it's cooler. But in the sun, six, seven to 10 o'clock, it's time to head home. All right, so let's see. All right, All right let's flip it over. Nah, it's not ready yet. Let me let it cook a little bit longer, you guys, a little bit longer. All right, guys, we're done. We are done, I believe. I think we are. I want to make sure. Oh, yeah, they ready. They ready. YouTube there you go there you go YouTube pan full of fillets guys a pan full of fillets so I got 12 fillets six fives with the tails 18 pieces of fish off of six fish I utilized the entire fish 18 pieces silent stuff would feed a family so that's all you need guys to feed your family man go out there and get you five or six nice crappies bam get you three bass bam cup of catfish bam throw you some size and you're good to go let me fix my plate and we about to sit down and eat all right guys i'm at the end of the video thank god i'm starving so here we go guys here we go got the crappie filet got the tail got the fried chicken from my wife got some chip hot sauce water that's all I need, guys. I'm gonna take a bite. Y'all have a great one, cause it's gonna be real quick, cause I'm starving. Oh. And you guys better give me some likes and some views, cause I'm working my butt off. So, there you go, guys. Put a little of that Louisiana hot sauce on it, right there. Take a bite of this. Y'all know what it is with crappies. I ain't gotta tell you. Put a little hot sauce on that tail. Y'all know where it is, crap, bite that tail. God, it's as good as you get. Crap, just top of the line. God, have a blessed day, man. Continue to stay hydrated, stay safe. Till next time, peace.